Hi guys, Charles Love here again from Big Sur Technologies and uh, I just wanted to show you how to create multiple Outlook signatures. We've had a couple of calls come in recently and I just kind of wanted to make a quick video to show you. Um, basically what you do is you open up a message okay normally and this is Outlook 2010 so if you're on the Big Sur cloud it'll look the exact same. So you compose a message and then you go up to here where it says signatures click on it and then click down here to signatures again. This will bring up the signature wizard, okay? And as you can see, I currently have two distinctive um, signatures. I have one that's called Clove Office and I have one that says Clove 404. Um, and I'll explain that in a second. So the Clove Office one is my default signature, the one that everyone sees on all the thousands of emails I send you. And then in some, for some cases, I do send some stuff out with, you know, Scout. So I actually have a second signature here, but most of my stuff is going under here. If it turns out that you don't want um, a full-blown signature, you want to have an optional one, let's just call it new, and let's just call it quick. And on this quick, I can just go, uh, you know, thanks, put a dash there. Alright, so that'll be my quick signature. So what I what I can do here is if you have multiple mail accounts, you can pick the mail account here, and then you can say for new messages use this, but for replies use quick. Okay, so you can specify what a new message looks like and what a reply looks like. So I'm gonna hit OK. And then what I'll do here is if I am going to reply to an email, um, let's see. Let's go ahead and hit reply. What you'll see is it's now using the quick reply versus the normal reply. But for whatever reason, if I want to make that a full reply, I can come down here and just say that. And poof, there, it's now the full reply. So very handy. Again, if you want to get to it, you go signatures, signatures, you specify the account, you specify the new, and then the reply makes things easy for you. Alright, well, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye.